I have no idea when she's going to release it. Got it. Got it. Wow. See how many just released it. Go ahead and tell me. There you go. Good. Full. There you go. A longer time under tension as I'm pulling. Yeah. Is what I feel. I'm pulling trauma. And then you not telling me that you're releasing it. Yeah. I can then explode up. Yep. So, but I feel like I've been doing like three or four sets of rack pulls. Wow. So it's this, this button up here. Okay. So you're going to press on it to, for it to hold. Okay. And then releasing the button will release it. Okay. So just hold it. And yep. Okay. <sighs> there it is. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Pull, 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 pull. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, shoot. Two more like that. Yep. Pull, 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 pull. Oh, yeah. Oh. Good. Oh my gosh. Yeah. This is just a easier way of doing it. Right, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, there's a nice, nicer way of doing it. This thing's <laughs> right. hard. So, so I gotta make sure I get my starting position properly. Yes. And really um I can feel like my rhombo weight too though, too. Yeah. Wow. Alright, let's go. Okay, ready? Let's see. Get a good grip. Even hands. My, uh, my grip's off a little yeah, bit. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, going to the line. All right, bring us to the old days, Jimmy. I know. Okay, ready? Yep. Good. Nice. Good pull. Pull. Nice. And pull. There we go. Pull. There we go. Pull. Good work. <laughs> Hopefully the form's a little better. Trying to get yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, you're, you're constantly just pulling, pulling, pulling. Trying to get the big girl off your back. <laughs> God. You don't need a lot, of, a lot of sets of this. No, you don't. I mean, especially okay. for, wow. Shoulders back. You know when you're seeing this is rock? When you're out of breath <laughs> after the working set. Oh yeah. Yeah, my seeing this is like, what's going on? Oh yeah. Okay, whenever you're ready. All right. I swallowed my gum last time. You swallowed your gum last time? <laughs> yeah, I, I sucked in my air and my gum went, whoop. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yep, pull, 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 pull. <sighs> nice. Lock it locked in. Pull, 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 pull. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's what we want. Come on. Pull, 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 pull. Yeah. Good. Oh, Good. One, one more. more. Yep. Come on. Okay. Yep. Really slow. Keep pulling. Keep pulling all the way through. You drive, 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 drive. Uh, yeah. Oh my gosh. This is incredible. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, completely. It different. like completely sets you like right I, back from the from the um yeah. the, the beginning starting position. We are yeah. supposed to in the and traditional. I felt more way way more erector involvement and just yeah my back felt a lot more stable. Right. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. 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 It's yeah. forced you to keep everything in line. Great point. Like I told Jimmy, I was, uh, I worked with uh, Pete Bremer. He's like one of the bigger deadlifters in the world right now. Okay. He's talking about when you grab that deadlift bar, rolling your elbows in, that way you engage the lats easier. Mm. Oh, wait a minute. Something that I've, I've never been told. Never heard of it. That makes sense. Roll the elbows in? Yep. So when you're here, like a lot of people are deadlifting here. Right? Yep. Pete yes. rolls in here and that tightens up his upper back. Oh, I feel my lat. Wow. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. 955. Yeah. He's on the board at 860 at 275. I mean, this is amazing. I want to try that. Uh, the Reverse uh, hyper? Reverse hyper. Which one do you want to try? Um, they're all new to me, man. So I'm, I'm game, man. We're your guinea pig. This is the real, these are real, look at this. These are years of rust. <laughs> Memories right here, I'm sure, of like some oh, grace yeah. using this. There we go. Make sure we are accurate here. Oh yeah, big difference of weight. Slow it down. Yeah. 
Good. Oh, yeah. Ooh. 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 Okay. Okay, so look up. And then okay. Down. okay. You know, it's funny. I, in the past, I've done four cores each side before. My form must have been crap because this seems heavy as hell right now. Really? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, hands down. It's but it's good. Down. The more you slow it down, the more you're going to get that traction, the more you're going to get that, that pump in your lower back. So, I feel uh, already. Because you're lifting the weight a little bit more than you are so. Okay. Wow. So the same thing I told them was like, just make sure that you brace your stomach on the way up. Okay. You want to try to pause for one second at the top. Okay. And you want to keep your legs in contact with it, control the down, but you want to see the weights. You want to look down at the ground and see the weights coming. Okay. So are you kind of rounding your back at the bottom yep, a little bit? Yep. Like looking uh, down and rounding? Gotcha. Okay. Four is better than mine. Yeah. Way better than mine. Way better. Yep. Oh, yeah. Ooh, shoot. Oh, yeah. Like when you see that, when you see that come off the back of your legs, you're trying to swing it up and uh -huh. try to over extend. Okay. You don't okay. want to hyper extend. Got it. Okay. So I think I have a tendency to hyper extend. Same here. Yeah, and probably sling it. Yeah. yeah, same here. Like yeah. Yep, like, exactly. Right. You're just trying to get it up to the usual spot and get back down. Huh. The same way when you deadlift, right? You don't want to come here. This right. Is right. Good, right. Yeah. Stop. Okay. So note to self, drop the weight. Don't hyper extend. There you go. That's much better. Yeah, that looks good. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I was just watching it. Oh, my God, man. Nice. Yeah, it's so tough. Yeah. Way tougher me, that way. You see me sliding off here. Way tougher. I had a hard time getting my timing right with my, um, yeah. So it took me a minute to get used to that okay. repetition. I am so glad that this man here, Jimmy, showed us power thing in general. Because before we even met, years and years and years, years ago, I, we were your typical bodybuilder just doing typical, you know, lat pull downs yeah. and typical boring stuff. Yeah. And, um, the reason why our, our shape the way it is now with the dents that we have is due to the, the training. Yeah. You know, the hyper, reverse hypers, heavy rack pulls, um, deadlifts on the floor, heavy box squats. Yeah. That all came from, from, mm -hmm. from Jim Sizer's training. Absolutely. Yeah. We always say weight, uh, weight training is the, definitely the fountain of youth. Yep. yep. Hands it down. Is. If you do it the right way. Exactly. Yeah. That's the, the right. caveat. Yeah. 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 There it is. Much better. Yeah. Let it sling you all the way under. Better form than I did. Yeah, perfect. She always gets a better than I do. Yep, stay tight. Stick with it. Wow. Much better. Amazing, yep. Stronger erectors definitely will um, help with uh, back, if you potential back injuries in the future. Money, yeah, it's money. She catches on quick, man. Right there. Uh, yeah, exactly. Exactly. Accountable. Yeah. Good point. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Because here, someone comes around and you're doing a crap rep. Oh, man. Oh, oh my God. Start over. That's the way it should be. Way different. Here, you said that too. You said here that you, do, you basically do a crap rep, you don't count, do them all over again. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> when I That's okay. focused on slowing the movement down, making sure I wasn't swinging and hyperextending really? at the top, way different. Wow. I feel so all a, of my erectors, my glutes, mainly my erectors, but you're gonna want this whole back, really? posterior chain is just tight, lit up. Wow. Try to keep that is forward. tough. You'll fill them oh, man. Your calves there that are supposed to do that. Okay. Just try to stick with it, keep your, your heels on it, and let the traction go all the way under. So basically, this is going to be just like, like a... Yep, just okay. like a reverse hyper, but it's going to be a lot more traction. Oh. So get into it as normal, like, uh, like yep, here? Uh, I put one foot on your, put your foot on the step. Oh, okay. Like this? Yep. So you want to come through the side. There you go. And now you're going to hop onto the pad. And just goes normal? Just, just like that. What's going to happen? Mm. Yep. <laughs> oh my oh god. My gosh. Nice and controlled. Right. You want higher? Nice. And then when you're 
then you're going to go to the top position and rack it. Tell me when you're ready. Okay, three more. One. Bigger uh, Two. Oh my god. Whew. You feel that higher degree of traction? Oh yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> oh yeah, man. There's no joke. Damn. That I can see that working. It's a difference. Upper. I thought more my upper area here. Really? Yeah. And you're going to get a lot more traction pulling under too, so you're going to get a more aggressive pull on that, that tailbone. It's definitely way more aggressive. So what you're going to want to do though is you want to make sure, because of where this is sitting, you're wanting to still hyper center. So you're okay. trying to go to that higher position. So you want to get in here. Probably not in jeans. <laughs> and you're, you want to really control this. So you're here. Uh, okay. 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 Ah, uh, okay. That's smooth. Makes sense. Okay. Wow. I would go no weight. Yeah. Maybe a five just to, so you get something on No weight that. sounds fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> the key is, is like, in your head, you'll start to panic because you'll be like, this is so uncomfortable, and that's what's making you want to go fast. Okay, it's yes, so yes. That's a good point. Yeah. I got uncomfortable when I started getting sloppy. Exactly. Yeah, that's what I noticed too. Oh, okay. All right. I so. feel like I've been deadlifting. Five or six sets. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. Oh goodness! All right. Ooh. Ooh, shoot. Yep. yep. Top. Yep. Nice. Tell me when you're done. We'll rack it up. Nice. Ooh. Okay. Five more. Nice. Oh, one more. Last full row. Yep. Back up. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. How'd you feel? Oh, that was hard. I was like, I don't know. You're right. I do feel it a little higher. Yeah, I feel a little higher. But just, just how much harder it is, just controlling the weight and not swinging it. Yep. Oh my gosh, that's such a game changer. This will increase your, your squat, your deadlift. Yeah. I mean, as you're putting, it's strengthening your entire posterior chain. This is lovely about this. And that's where a lot of times where folks have back issues because their lower erectors, lower back are weak. So that's when it gets to crumble like a foundation of a home. If, if your foundation is weak, you can best believe over time, something's gonna crumble. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. you gotta bulletproof your lower back before worrying about trying to deadlift super heavy weight. Yes. That's what I and when you first get started doing reverse hypers and, and work like this on your low back, it's going to hurt, trust me. Discomfort. You're gonna have yeah, discomfort. Not yeah, not yeah. pain hurt, but it is, there's gonna be some discomfort and you're gonna be sore. Um, don't let that deter you. It'll get easier and easier. And I mean, it's like you said, it's the foundation. Yep. You gotta have a strong foundation. So don't, yeah. don't neglect it. Yeah, and with proper form like that too, I can feel the blood just being centered right here where it's supposed to be. Yeah. You know, so this is, this is I feel amazing. all, yeah. Yeah, right I feel mind. like I've been doing, I'm serious, like, like five or six deadlifts on the floor. I'm dead serious. There's yeah. so much blood back here right now. That's yeah. I haven't had a pump like that in, in my erectors in a while. Like, I think my best set of reverse hypers was 600 on the chain. 600? 600? The best I was ever able to do on this was 325. Damn. 325s on this? It's incredibly hard. That's, <laughs> that's, a per, that's a perfect example where strength is not correlated with size. You know, people think they see big guys, oh, what do you bench? You know, it's five or 600 pounds. No, nah, not 300 pounds. You know, core of strength is not correlated with size yeah. at all. Very specialized movement too, right? Yeah. Exactly, yeah. exactly. Just try to control it all the way through. Okay. So you get the movement started, just do a little rock, get it moving. Okay. And then you're going to get it up. And this is going to really show you how far wow. you want to go up because you're hyperextending because it's so light. Sure. You're not going to be able to hyperextend. Yes. I believe you're probably it. not even going to be able to go to the still, maximum, feel, but it's going to get you there. You'll feel it and you'll oh, feel yeah. what the chain does. Oh, okay. Yeah. What, like what I said, if you don't do it evenly, it's going to be able to start to rush, it'll start to twist on you. Okay. Interesting. Oh, yeah, it's turning already. Yeah. yeah you want to pull that. nice and tight. And you have to jump up on this <laughs> one and you got the old school handle. Wow. Okay. All right, guys. All right, let's go. We got lightweight to a giant. Lightweight, you got this. Good. Go. Good. Nice. Nice. 
so down. Actually, it did. Yeah, you're right. Interesting. So this. Yeah. I felt more honestly. I felt more controlled using this than I did with the other one. Really? Yeah. Dead yeah. serious. Wow. Heck no. I think you can. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can do it. Like I said, yep. just get it rocking to get started. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh yeah. There's that feeling. <laughs> I don't know. The, I see those big. Oh man! All right. Well, the first. Ooh. Oops. Okay. You may have to help yeah, get the like thing on me. Oh my. Okay. Okay. Oh my yep. gosh. Whoa. Yep. Told you. <sighs> you ain't Ooh. working unless the, unless the, the weights are screaming. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Love it. There it is. <laughs> Gosh, yes. there's a different level of control you have to have with this one because you're right, you've got the. Yep, yeah. You know, just those three moves we did here, I feel like I've had an entire back workout. Really? I oh, know. Yeah. My low back, yeah. It feels like our old oh, deadlift days. Smoked it. Yeah. I, I thought when I got, I said, well, let's do a few things and go train for them an hour. <laughs> it's not happening. <laughs> no. Yeah. That's not yeah, happening, it's, buddy. It's not happening. <laughs> so my, my CNS right now is, is just, just right. Yeah. I got so much blood in my back right now, man. It's, it's crazy. But nothing replaces fibers. You're right. Yeah. yeah. As a memory, I just. Yeah. Man. It's a great reminder to keep at them. Absolutely. Sure. Yeah. Keep at them. And these tilt too. Like, so these tables will tilt this way. They do? Really? Yeah. So if you look, there's pins on each side. Okay. You're getting less traction. And when it's tilted the opposite way, you're going to get a lot more. Oh, that makes yeah. That makes yeah. sense. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. Yeah, that's probably for the more elite type guys. I was like, how you guys have to go flat and yeah. just kind of build up that moment? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Well, man, we appreciate you, brother, man. Um, my back yeah. is smoked. <laughs> you got some more items?